Oh, hi. It's me again, the out of shape hiker. Today, I'm solo and I'm attempting an overnight. I started at the North Twin Trailhead. I'm gonna try and hit the two Twin Peaks and uh, Guy Guyot, Goit, and uh, stay at the tent site that's up there. We'll see how this goes, we'll see how far I get. And if I decide to continue to other peaks today or tomorrow, or if I decide to come back down today. I don't know, we're winging it. Just a uh, quick word of advice for anybody heading up to the Twins, to North Twins, from the uh, trailhead. This is, it's a pretty easy to find trail, but it's not marked, like at all. There's a couple parts where you might have to do like a double take to find out the right way to go. I'm tracking this trail with my uh, Garmin Instinct Solar watch. It does a pretty good job of beeping and yelling at me if I'm off course, so. Although not foolproof, I do have a compass and map with me just in case. Oh, look at that. That is actually the first trail marker that I've noticed the whole time. So I guess I have to cross. Okay, I'm across. A little dicey. Tell you what. This is, uh, doesn't seem to be a super popular trail, at least not today, but it is spooky hiking by yourself. Whew. I can't decide whether or not to put the rain jacket on at the cost of the extra heat and sweat. I think no rain jacket right now. Well, I put the rain jacket on, which uh, might have been a huge mistake since I was already soaked. <laughs> now, I think I'm soaked on the inside and the outside. Not smart. I'm sorry if there's chocolate all over my mouth. Okay. Let's go. If anyone's wondering, does it rain in a cloud? It does. Well, this is a disaster. I am completely soaked all the way through and through. I got a dry change of clothes um, in a waterproof sack in my bag, but I got no idea how well this uh, waterproof pack, uh, this waterproof cover on my pack is doing. For all I know, my sleeping bag could be soaked, which would put me in big trouble. So. I'm just not experienced enough at this yet. I'm gonna turn back and, and head back down to the truck. So I got four miles back down to the trailhead. I hate to quit, but I mean, safety first. You know, it's, it's, it's too far away to mess around. Better safe than sorry, right?
Uh-uh. I've seen that horror movie. Nope. It saddens me to say, folks, that this is the best view of my day. A parking lot. I'm gonna call this trip a failure. Um, I bet normally this is quite beautiful and rewarding, but I'll be totally honest, there were a few times up there on that hike that I got a little scared. What if I twist an ankle up here? <sighs> anyway. Well, I didn't exactly earn this, but I'm still hungry. So, it's a good thing nothing happened to me up on trail, because... Yikes. I'm glad I didn't push on and test the weather. Test my body. Kind of bummed out, but anyway live to hike another day. Peace out, y'all.